In this example, we are given that a hundred watt bulb having luminous efficiency ten lumen per watt is placed at a distance root three meter from a screen S, as we can see here. And we are required to find the luminous intensity on a screen at a point P as given in the figure. Now, in this situation, the very first thing we can find out is the luminous flux of bulb. This can be given as phi is equals to luminous efficiency multiplied by the radiant flux. So here it will be ten multiplied by hundred. That is thousand lumen. And using luminous efficiency, as we have calculated the luminous flux, we can also calculate the luminous intensity of the bulb, as it can be treated as a point isotropic source. So here, luminous intensity of bulb we can write as L is equals to phi by four pi, as we are assuming it is emitting light energy in all directions uniformly. So it will be thousand divided by four pi. That will be two fifty by pi candela, and as we are having the luminous intensity of bulb in all directions, then at point P, as if this angle is taken as theta, using Lambert cosine rule, we can find out the illuminance of bulb on a screen. At point P, as this can be directly given as I, which is the luminous intensity on a screen, that can be written as L cos theta by R square. So here this will be two fifty by pi multiplied by here this angle theta we can take as sixty degree. So here cos sixty will be one by two divided by R square. If this is the distance R. The value of R we can calculate as root three by cos sixty degree. That will be two root three meter. So if we use this value over here, illuminance on the screen at point P, we can write as one twenty five as this one twenty five by pi multiplied by two root three whole square. If we simplify the values here, this will give us three point three two lakhs. Ah, that will be the answer of this problem.